Because why would anything good ever happen? This is Barbie for the Nintendo Entertainment System, and it was my punishment game, because I could not complete Half Minute Hero in under two hours. In fact, it took me two hours and three minutes. So, uh, let's do this. Thanks, Red Armor. We've got a timer. We might as well run it whilst we're playing. So, looks like Barbie here has been staying up far too late and reading too many books. And she's looking forward to tomorrow because she's going to eat at the soda shop, playing around at the beach and meeting Ken. I didn't play with Barbie dolls. I had Action Man as a kid because I'm manly like that. So, indeed, finally, a uh, punishment game that's actually punishment. Thanks, Red. So, we're Barbie. We strut, we jump, and we throw lumps of quartz? I, I don't even know. And I don't know what that just did either. And balls hurt us. Okay, right. We're, we're gonna have to learn together on this one. No, I... Oh, okay. Right, my zzzz bar goes up when I collect these balls. And my scores goes up for what that's worth. Right, select changes between these things, which Red has told me affects these little quart things that I throw out. And, yeah, start is pause. Okay. Wow. Okay, that's... That hurts. So we don't want to get hit by, uh... Badminton thingamajiggers. And the jumping is a little horrible, so let's just ignore that. Alright, little buddy. Fly for me. Okay. He'd... How does this throwing thing work? Alright, so the longer I hold the button down, the further the things I throw go. Good to know. Alright, let's just steam through this. Okay, we've got a flying bee. We're flickering, so I guess we're invincible. Mario style. Uh, well, I'm not having fun. But let's, let's plow through this. Oh, I never did start the timer, did I? For what it matters, we're not playing for time here. Okay, we got another ball of bee down there, so... Oh, come on. There we go. Whew. Hey, I got the skills of this game. So I'm guessing that zzzz bar is our health, and when that f fails completely, we die, wake up, break up with Ken. Oh, that's actually quite a nice little mechanic there. Unlike the jumping. What is this game even marketed towards? I don't know many girls that had uh, Nintendo Entertainment Systems as we lasses. Okay, cat, what are you even doing? But you're the only thing here, so I'm guessing you have to do it. Um... Sure. Oh, what am I even doing with my life? So what is the general reception of this game? I mean, it doesn't really seem to have the makings of an awful game, but it's... Okay, where did that little animal just go? Oh. Okay, I don't know what happened, but... Free power-ups for me? 
Okay, is that a little present thing that I can walk into? It looks kind of like a gift wrap present. And now we have the invisible woman throwing her shoes at me. Uh, sure, do you, do you want a diamond? Good lord, she's naked. don't know what I'm doing or meant to be doing here, but I win, I guess. Congratulations, you've completed level, and I got 10 b-balls. Thank you. Ken will be so impressed. Hmm, I got a new outfit. Now, does that hurt me or boost me up? Okay. She doesn't like being sprayed with water. Probably messes her hair up or something. Does that hurt as well? Probably also does. But at least there's no timer on this game. So I can take my time. Not quite as bad as uh, Bart Simpson versus the Space Mutants now. There's a difficult game of a similar vein. Oh, and I got my Barbie invincibility. Shame it doesn't help with the platforming at all. Which is just awful. She's got quite the strut to her, though. I imagine most of the work in this game went into uh, animating that. Okay, so it's one of those trick levels where the way to do it best is just keep moving forward. Yeah, okay. Actually, we are getting ravaged here. <laughs> Too good. Where is... where's the fun in this game? Who was this marketed towards? Who bought it? Hmm, actually I get this feeling I'm about to die. Alright, this is nightmare fuel. No, back to sleep. God, you look creepy. Alright, back here. So we have to do all that again, but with considerably less getting injured. Well, somebody did say this is a deceptively hard game, so... How long is it? And do I have to do all of it? of our invulnerability by failing at the jumps miserably. Ugh. Okay, no, this isn't going well at all. by a little girl's game. Alright, third time a charm. About 40 minutes if I recall correctly, but that's probably not a first time playthrough. Hmm. Alright, we'll go by my timer then. If I can get this done in under two hours, then maybe I can even add it to the two hours of hell list. An involuntary addition to the list. Why do they feel the need to make that the jumping noise? It's like, here's a sound the gamer's going to hear a lot of. Let's make it really loud and awful. I wonder if I've just become more critical of games, because now I have to test them. I 
All right, now why is it not coming out this time? There we go. Oh, okay, Sh sure. I thought the bee balls gave us a bit more than that last time. Crazy ass fish. Ah, hello, aristocrat. I hope you can hang around for about ten minutes more. Okay. Seems to be nothing in this B block this time. Let's study our enemy. And get hit anyway. I oh, know this feels like the end. Let's not smudge the finish. So fish comes out, and we go for it. Yeah, too good, frankly. Right now, waterfalls. Now, these really are not things that should hurt one. So, maybe she's worried about her mascara running or messing up her hair. My only exposure to Barbie was uh, adverts on the TV as a kid, so I don't know what she's all about. Looking good and impressing Ken seemed to be the gist of it. If only I had known her starring role in iconic video games, I might have taken more of a liking to her. Oh, I've only got one health point left. Hopefully, waking up on this uh, part of the level doesn't bring me all the way back. Barbie dissolves in water, didn't you know? Well, I do now, thank you. Should have known, aristocrat, you were the go-to man for Barbie trivia. Now, for what it's worth, I woke up today feeling pretty ill after having a dream about playing as France. So, perhaps it's only fitting that I now play a game about having uh, nightmares. Okay, what is this? It's a... thing. My favourite kind of thing. no idea what's going on. I would assume it's one of those things that attacks enemies around you, but there are no enemies in this game. Oh, okay. Agitates birds. We'll go with that. I'm trying to remember what was so horrible about my dream France. I was just playing as France. Fighting over Normandy and, uh... Just... Woke up feeling sick after that. Alright, what do we have to do now? Okay, sh Sure. This is anyone's guess what's going on. Okay, right, I gotta close whatever these things are. 
with my quartz. Granted, it's a little tricky to time those things that you throw. So the longer you hold it down, the further they go. In a very non-intuitive way. What? What? Okay, back to Nightmare Fuel Girl, who sleeps sitting upright. Okay, now she wants to be a mermaid in her dreams. We'll roll with this. yet to find a game that is not improved by having underwater sections. Okay, probably better to die and get all of our health back. Or not. Okay, game over. We're gonna give this one more try before I go and hang myself. At least now we know exactly how it all goes. And I know that I need to conserve it, because I get three lives and not a single one more. Okay, sure. Bit of a tricky jump, that. all a metaphorical pit of death. Yeah, I'll roll with that. This game is some very subtle nightmare fuel, actually. But we need to gather all the bee balls that we can to keep our sleep meter high. Kiting before it was a strategy. Just saying that word makes me want to play um, Killing Floor again. Huh, we're getting not too bad at this. It is, however, the water level I'm not looking forward to here. Uh, not the water... Well, yes, the water level, with all the water fountains and such. So let's try and store up all of our z z z, -z for it. Now those look like empty paper bags, but I'm guessing they are dresses or tank tops. So what are my two other items here? The we've got the bow tie or the ribbon, the diamond and the heart. What do they even do? I'm sticking with the diamond since it hasn't done us wrong so far. Even strips invisible lady here. Pulse Monkey Hardy says, DDR Jake, may I ask an EU4 related question? By all means, anything to take my mind off of this. Forty minutes of this game? I, that I don't like the sound of. 
But here's my thought. In 1991, most girls weren't playing Nintendos. The cool ones were, but that wasn't all of them. And I don't think a boy would be all that happy receiving this game. Again, speaking generally here. Don't want to judge you and your hobbies. So who was this game made for? Maybe the answer is me. <laughs> Didn't sell any copies, they were just waiting for this moment. Ah, sod it, let's just go for the ball. Completely undoing any sleepy advantage that I had there. Somebody says it looks like a very punishing game, Jake, like you wouldn't believe. Alright. Ah, oh, this is tricky. I'll just blitz through it. No problem. Oh wow, that went surprisingly tight. Oh, shoot, let's not walk into the waterfall. Went through this level last time without a hitch. Let's try for it again. So we can uh, live like a mermaid after, after all. It's actually pretty hard to take my eyes off of this whilst uh, trying to read the chat here. Somebody had a... Oh, it's a wall of text time. I was playing as Chavs the other day, I noticed that the new exploration system does not allow... does not allow to explore across the straight line that separates Asia and the Americas. Is that an intended... blah 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 blah. Um, you explore by trade nodes, if I'm not mistaken. Don't see how that would cause any trouble, but I haven't checked that explicitly. Big nerf for Japan, East Asians. Well, probably just need a bit more range. But, yeah, like I said, I haven't tried, so what can I say? Is this meant to be? Am I invincible as well? I'll just assume so and blitz through it. So I'll take a moment to thank Red for his impeccable choice of punishment games. Turk says, I hate this game's sound, so at least you can just mute it. Me, I've got it thumping into my head through my headphones. Actually, with these tables like this, it does look like some kind of post-apocalyptic food court. And this whatever it is... Easy peasy. Alright, let's live like a mermaid. Or enjoy the little cutscene of getting our dress. The fried rice says, why are you doing the same missions over again, Jake? 
Uh, I died on the mermaid level, and it seems you only get three lives. Lose them all, and Barbie wakes up for good, and decides to stop going back to sleep. Time to go to the beach and be a mermaid. Alright. If only, like, if only she was one of the mermaids with a fish on top and a uh, woman on the bottom. able to get that? Yeah, there we go. I just want this to be over, so we're thumping our way through it. Hmm. Nah, the top seems like a trap to me. Well, maybe not. feels more like a welcome to Contra stage than a uh, here enjoy being a mermaid stage. Also I wonder what my hitbox is. I get the feeling it's just her center. Yep. Is that seahorse good or bad? Maybe I should have read the manual before playing this game. Okay, I would like the underwater section to be over, much like the rest of this game right about now. Teasing me with fake walls and real walls. No, God. Taste my watery gems. Okay, that one does nothing. That one does a similar amount of nothing. There is no escape. Alright. Okay, he just... No, not again! This would be nightmare fuel. Heck, it is nightmare fuel. I want that. There we go. Score is the only thing that ever matters, so we'll collect all of these. I don't know what is going on, but I want it to end. Oh, the graphics in this look quite a lot like Faxanadu, actually. And the gameplay is every bit as pleasant, am I right? What What is even going on? I don't know. I'm having that strange ball thing again. What is what is going on? I'm just being thrown around now. But I'm not taking any damage, so let's just power through all of this. Good. Glad that's over. Okay, this seems like boss time, but...
but what do I have to do for it? Feed the crabs at the bottom, maybe? Or attack this thing? Uh... Yes! That! What the? Okay, apparently there was something locking up the crabs that we opened up. Sure. Can we stop being a mermaid now? Can we be, I don't know, Ken? Teach all the girls to be very materialistic. No, Barbie, it was not fun. It was anti fun. Liking this look, though. gem thing seem to affect the uh, magnet there and it's gonna steal don't even know what that is I'm tempted to say a CD but I can't even remember if CDs were uh, the thing in 1991 what Now, Barbie here didn't like being covered in water. I don't think she would enjoy being covered in soda. I'm kind of glad there's no time limit here now. Alright, so maybe they need a different kind of gem. Aha! That's actually kind of clever. So I want you to keep moving, and then when you're there... Ah. Pathetic. No! Okay, apparently that worked. Probably would have been faster and not much trouble just to walk through it. That looks like trouble. Trouble brewing. <laughs> Drink milk, folks. Healthier for you and half the price of soda. in this direction as well. Okay, so what I want you to do then is knock off that, let's just say it is a CD, and now I can have it. Oh Trouble's brewing again. And now the sky is dripping. I don't... Whatever, our sleep bar is plenty full. Hamburglar, help us out. What a guy. What a guy. T difficult game, they said. And I am unashamedly liking Barbie's new look here. Oof. 
trouble brewed for us there. <laughs> Alright, Popcorn Man, what do you do? Okay, I think I want you to do that when you are underneath the CD. What a cool little strut he's got. Not a care in the world. And eat that up. No! It brewed for too long. I agree. The jumping sound is horrible. Please, America, help me out. Ah! Excellent. Now that's a feature I want to see in more games. The firing of offensive beef patties. Can I hit that thing? Because it's otherwise going to get in my way here. Okay, so I have the trouble that I can't jump over here. What can you do to help me? Maybe if you stop moving with this thing? Or do something magical? I don't even know. Ah! You blow up my skirt and that makes me jump higher. Like I said, this isn't a terrible game. It's not even that bad. Or maybe my standards have just fallen way too low. I forget it. I think my sleep meter is too full for that CD. Jake got any more neck-related puns ready? Mongolia into Great Can It Never Forget. I really enjoyed making that uh, little video about the neck puns. Okay, what even is this now? I think I need to turn all of these off. That's worked for most of them. <laughs> Jake, did you do World Conquest in this game yet? Not yet. I want to become Burger. Okay, I don't even know. What? <laughs> My thinking there was, ah, yes, I can propel myself off this spoon, and then I tried to do it, it didn't work. And then it worked when I didn't think it would. Ah, can't handle these freedom fries. It's a sigh of unimpressed. Oh, not more of this, please. This game has gotten Jake to attempt to bribe a spoon. Just getting ready for the uh, new parliament mechanics, you see. I need to know how to bribe properly. Well, this is terrible. I'm almost out of sleep. And I do not want to have to redo all of this.
Let's go. Yes. I want the bee. Really is these segments that destroy me. Oof. Safety sleep. Time for dessert. Okay, time for some thick shakes. What now? Okay, interesting. It kind of thumps down and uh, knocks me down from wherever I stand. Which is going to get quite risky when I'm... No! Ah. Critically damaged by... A jumping milkshake. That's alright, I can see it coming. Too good for this. Or not. Go to sleep, horror girl. Whew, thank goodness, we're just back to thick shakes. Not back to the start of this whole uh, soda bar escapade. seeing how I can tell where those uh, cherries are going to hit. So my plan is just to blitz my way through this before I can get many opportunities to be hurt. Three hundred viewers for the Barbie Nez game, holy crap. Yeah, that must be some kind of record. Whoa, wait, what? Okay, so the floor hurts me. Alright, so I can walk on these. Oh, okay. We're already one life down and we're getting close to our second. If we fall off of this, it does seem like it's going to be quite tricky to get back on. Ah, these illuminated records hurt. Ah, that's what they would have been, records. Well, that's the cruelest of game mechanics. Sorry, you couldn't manage our game of hit detection. Now you go right back to the start. And okay, the floor doesn't hurt me. Just makes it look like it hurts. This is more like a fever dream. Alright, second time of charm here. Alright, we're getting hurt, but we'll just tank it. Please, no! Not to the start. Hey, mommy, I managed to complete that Barbie game for the NES you got me. And at that moment you sell your demon child off to slavery. Oh, 
Although maybe if I had completed this as a kid, I would have been considerably better at platformers. <clears throat> the cruelest thing is knowing that even if I pass this horrible bit, I have one bit of life bar left. I'll probably get hit and be forced to do all this again. But I dare not just take the hit on purpose, because then I'm down to my last life. And that creates nerves. And makes failure all that more likely. Oof, okay. Go back to sleep, demon child. I wonder if you can just hold right when you start there and you'll pretty much spawn on top of those uh, music notes. Alright, we know how to do this. We'll get through it. No problem. One shot and all that. Oh. On a frustration scale from 1 equals failing a three mountains run in the late 1600s to 10 equals playing as Livonian order, where would you put this? Um... One is failing at 1600s. I, I don't think that was frustrating at all. Which I guess is why it's uh, the one on the scale. Hmm. Yeah, I'm going to give it a solid six. Mostly because the sound effects are awful and the music is, well, non-existent because of the sound effects. It's got that early game thing where too many sound effects just overwhelm the music to the point where you don't really hear it in all its glory. Let's enjoy it for a little bit. Okay, that was as much of a little bit as you're going to get, because I'm not enjoying that at all. Just tank the hit here so that we can have a bit of consistency jumping through these. And then what the heck were these? Alright, they look like falling platforms. I had just assumed they were something that uh, you bounce off of. Or maybe I have to hit them with one of these, but that would be super cruel since I'm standing on one of those illuminated records. Ugh. This is where all the rejected music notes from Banjo-Kazooie ended up. If only I hadn't messed up on Half Minute Hero on the penultimate level, I wouldn't be here right now. Oh. Suffering like G did. Alright, we got this. I'm feeling it this time. Maybe I'm just going mad. See, at least if this was a difficult level with lots of things to hurt you, I could have just game over it and been like, well, that was Barbie, folks. Wasn't that fun? But no, it's just a fairly horrible... Fairly horrible platforming section with very little that can hurt you. I'm sorry, Sasha. Oh, nice backwards jump. That came straight out of Castlevania. Just tanking that hit in the hope that I can be put out of my misery soon enough. <laughs> and there's plenty of misery to go around.
Where's my game, Genie? Where can I plug in the infinite jump code? Snake Rattle and Roll style. That was a funny one for Snake Lash for Snake Rattle and Roll. If you put in the infinite jump cheat, you would jump too high, and then you would die from falling damage. That is a truly horrible game, by the way, Snake Rattle and Roll. If you've ever played it, you know what I mean. If you haven't played it, I recommend you do so. Great music, and I believe it is the uh, smallest NES game in terms of file size. That was actually one of the things that uh, Rare challenged themselves to when they made it. It's like, we're going to make the smallest game ever. The cruelty is real. Can I switch out my character to uh, the kid from I Want to Be the Guy and enjoy a bit of double jumping? Okai Fern is clearly a next generation robot because no human would actually enjoy snake, snake rattle and roll. Alright, I'm feeling it this time for sure. Not even a shred of doubt in my mind. We are gonna break through this. Come on, Barbie. Ken is waiting for you. Just tank that hit. It's no big deal. Ponytails are low maintenance anyway. Oh, that's... just cruel. Hope we get all those coins back. even is. Okay, maybe I have to jump on the coins to keep them spinning? Any guesses? Oh, maybe I have to jump on them from great height to keep them spinning. Yeah! But for what purpose? coin doesn't stop spinning because these uh, these music notes are making my jumping a little tricky. Okay, it seems to be stuck in its... Oh, shoot. And those music notes to go somewhere. Good for me. To the right would be nice. That would not be nice. Okay, this one's falling, which isn't so hot. Alright, we're going to take the centre. Am I even doing here? Will you do something nice if I give you a question mark? I'm so confused. Can I just walk off the screen? No, no such luck. Okay, seems like this is how I die. It's 
So I jump from great height to get it spinning lots. And then what? Somebody says get all three spinning at the same time. Trust me, that's what I'm gunning for here. If these music notes will let me. Why did the one on the right stop spinning so soon? I think that's it. And that is how we die in Barbie, to a mysterious coin-spinning simulator. Alright, that was sufficiently punishing, like an hour or such, so... Yeah. Let's never speak of this again. And this is what I had to suffer for failing a half-minute hero. A game that I really should not have failed at, but I still did. Okay, I'm going to be back shortly with a Sagri Yogir. Uh, common sense campaign on Europa Universalis 4. Probably shouldn't be down for too long before that starts, so cheers everyone. Ciao for now, and... Just... Ugh.